Hello and welcome. My name is Matthias Schwendek. I'm the founder of Somatic Consent Education International and in this short whiteboard animation I'm going to introduce you to the values of Somatic Consent. This work is based on the Polyvagal Theory, which is about our ability to detect if we are safe or not safe when we engage with another person. Please check out the video link in the description for more information on this topic. Somatic consent is also about the function of the somatic nervous system. The somatic nervous system is divided in two parts. The sensory division that governs the inflow of information from our skin and sends impulses to the brain, enabling us to notice what we feel. And the motory division that controls our action by sending impulses from the brain to our muscles, allowing us to act and move. This is a neurological foundation for touch and connection. For somatic embodiment, we are looking to connect these two divisions of the somatic nervous system. To get there, we need a path of self-development that uses pleasure. It is important to realize that we can act in order to receive sensory pleasure. This might be touching a silk fabric because it feels good, or touching a partner for our own pleasure. Acting isn't always about giving pleasure to another person. We call this the base, the foundation of self-care in intimacy and physical connection. It's based on self-care, empowerment, boundaries and limits, self-pleasure and our rights and responsibilities. For this route of transformation, we just let our skin do the work. So when you engage with another, whenever it's a friend, lover or a colleague, are you doing it for yourself or is it for them? Or when it's their action, are they doing it for themselves or for you? This is a big difference and has a huge impact on intimacy and connection. When we add consent to these dynamics, it gives us some guidance on how to relate and communicate with others around us by clarifying who is doing the action and who is it for. One way of expressing consent is to ask for or give permission. This could be asking permission to do something for your own benefit. Can I? You touch them for your own pleasure. Or you could give someone permission to do something for their benefit. You allow them to touch you because it gives them pleasure. You can. Another example of consent is creating an agreement where the person is doing something for you. You could request an action for your benefit. They agree to give you a massage in exactly the way you want. Or an agreement where your action benefits the other person. For example, you agree to do a friend's shopping. In somatic consent, we call this dynamics the engagement zones. It is a map for personal and spiritual development, inspired by the Wheel of Consent developed by Betty Martin. These dynamics are transformed into a multidimensional map in a pyramid structure, beginning at the base where we integrate shadow dynamics and survival strategies. Moving into self-care and several levels of empowerment, we embody through practicing the engagement zones. At the top of the pyramid, the apex, we develop love and care that is offered unconditional as a gift to and from the world around us. And we merge into spiritual and transpersonal void beyond any concepts of duality. If you are inspired to delve deeper into somatic consent education, please like and subscribe. More about programs and sessions at www.somaticconsent.com. Thank you for watching.